It's getting crazy in that courtroom. I'm trying to tell y'all, it's going down in that courtroom. Listen, everybody is just everybody lying. Megan lying. Everybody lying. So far, it looked like Tori, the only one telling the truth. Let's listen into what Lawyer for Words got to say. Between her investigator and another L.A. County prosecutor and Kelsey and just replaying that recording and saying, Kelsey, didn't you say this? And Kelsey saying, I did. Kelsey, is that true? And Kelsey saying, no, I lied. Did the L.A. County prosecutors give Kelsey immunity? I think so. They did, didn't they? That's what I reported this morning. That's what I saw in this courtroom. Does Kelsey sound like a believable witness? No. <laughs> Is Tory Lanez accusing her of being the shooter? Yes. I'll tell you something. That jury, most of them, it looked like they had their mind made up. I don't know which way, but they saw that person say that I lied about all that to protect myself. They're going to hear that there was gunshot residue on her. And it gets crazier. We are on a 15-minute break. Got to get back into the courtroom very quickly. I sat at 12 o'clock directly in Kelsey's line of vision. I watched her testify. I watched her deny that Tory threatened to shoot her. I watched her confess that she lied to the police when she said that. The reason why she was lying to the police, the investigators, is because she wanted to protect herself. OMG. G. The rest of the testimony that we just saw in the after lunch session was a prosecutor holding on for dear life to a recording between her, a police investigator, and another L.A. County prosecutor. Baby, this is getting crazy, honey. Let me tell you something. I told y'all already what had happened. I've been told y'all this, what, last year? They fought over that gun. It's no way. It's no way. They fought over that gun. Meg got in her fucking feelings about a nigga that wasn't even hers. You fucking your friend, man. And you, man? Girl. Honey. I'm too big for certain situations. I've been through too much.